my government has done better than Obasanjo, Maru Musa Yaradua, Jonathan, Buhari boast despite facing advert failure. Hello, my wonderful people. Uh, Muhammad Buhari is blowing his own trumpet. The advice always goes that you don't mark your own script. The tendency and the, the thing there is that you will, you will overmark yourself and um, it's not, you don't, you don't, you're not a judge in your own case. But sadly, the president of this country is one of such persons who, you know, uh, put himself forward. Says he has done better than Obasanjo. I'm not saying Obasanjo was a saint, don't get me wrong. But at least we did not have your Fulani headsmen destroying lives and property. Omaru Musa Yaradua did some good. If for nothing, he ended in his time, the Niger Delta issue. What have you done to end the one that is on ground? Jonathan did not do much, but at least things were not this bad. You created the artificial insecurity that is now killing you. Because, you know, whoever digs a pit, what happens to the person? You fall into that very pit yourself. So this is what is happening to Buhari. And he's praising himself, calling himself you know, names. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe if this is your first time. Thank you. The current democratic dispensation began in 1999. And since then, Nigeria had had Olusegu Obasanjo, the late Maru Musa Yaradua, Good Luck Ebele Jonathan, and President Muhammadu Buhari as the current president. The President Muhammadu Buhari has boasted that in the last six years, his regime has performed better than any government since 1999. The current democratic dispensation began in 1999, and since then, Nigeria has had four presidents. Olusegun Obasanjo, Umaru Musa Yaradua, Good Luck Jonathan, and President Muhammad Buhari currently. Buhari noted this on Friday in his nationwide broadcast to Nigerians to mark the nation's 61st Independence Day celebration. Since coming to power, this administration has tackled our problem heads on in spite of the little resources we have at our disposal. No government since 1999 has done what we have done in the last six years to put Nigeria back on track. We shall continue to serve the country, listen to our people and protect our democracy and our country, Buhari boasted. Using data gathering from analysis, the researched arm of government under President Muhammadu Buhari, the economy has experienced rising food inflation. The current inflation has been seen in Nigerian GDP per capita fall to the level it was 40 years ago. This stood as a major parameter to let you know that Buhari has failed adversely. Unemployment at the rise. There have not been significant employment since he came on board. Currently, his presidency is characterized by a high unemployment rate of 33.3%, which naturally should be about 0.5%. GDP growth rate has been, since 2021, the highest inflation rate ever, 18.17, March 2021. The prime leading rates of 11.24 in April. The, this places the mysterious call at 62 index points. Buhari's administration has failed adversely. It has failed, but you are the only one who knows he has failed. He does not see it. He does not recognize it. He does not acknowledge that he has failed. To him, you are carrying out what we call a propaganda. You are not being honest. You are not being truthful. To him, he has done very well, very excellently well. Okay? And um, he's doing well in his own opinion, in his own, in his own eyes. You see? So this is what is happening. Buhari is saying to everybody that um, he's doing quite well, that in fact, he has built the economy, he has done A, B, C, D, Z, he's the best man for the job, Nigerians should be grateful and they should celebrate him. Now, this is why the country is not moving forward. If you cannot see anything wrong, there is no need to make a change. 
is when you come to the place called realization and you say, wow, this thing is not supposed to be so. I did not put this thing in order. That's when effort is being made. Yes? That's when effort is being made to put things in order. That's when effort is being made whatsoever to put things back on track. But when you think that there is no need for it, you can't even, you don't even realize that there is something wrong. So these are some of the things going on. These are some of the things happening. So wake up Nigerians. Buhari in his opinion, feel he has done excellently well. Buhari in his opinion has served Nigerians. I mean, they, can, they, they cannot be more grateful. In fact, Nigerians ought to just start worshipping his feet, you know, and just start, you know, uh, telling him and, you know, that you have done well, you know, lifting him up and celebrating him for the wonderful things he has done according to him, because he's celebrating himself, he's lifting himself, and he's telling the people that um, he's the one, he's the man up, uh, on board. So whether you like it or not, a lot of persons have begun campaign, and that's why, you know, APC is putting everything in place to ensure that they are the ones, you know, the people have no choice but to vote them. So, I mean, this is what is going on right now. Buhari is scoring himself that he is better than Obasanjo, is better than uh, Umaru Musa Yaradua. Umaru Musa Yaradua, like I earlier said, at least he did something good. Not much about his administration anyway. But for the fact, just, just like Buhari, he has a challenge in his administration. What is he doing towards that challenge? What is the way forward towards that challenge? How is he solving insecurity? So to Buhari, he has done well. Every other person has not done anything. You know, he's scoring himself, he said, I mean, as, uh, from what he's seen now, he's one of those who has done better than any other person. I mean, this is the man who has indebted the nation like no other person. As we speak, there is a request of him presently as we speak before the National Assembly, before Senate, to approve another four billion US, you know, dollars. What is it going to be used for? The one that was collected before, what has it been used for? So these are part of the things we should ask. Buhari is not just impoverishing the nation, he's impoverishing country children yet unborn, yet unborn. You see, I mean, it is what it is. God will help us. Leave us a comment. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless you. Have a good day. Bye for now.